At Karen Vineyard Church, we are committed to making disciples. So what does a true follower of Christ look like? And what does a follower of Christ do? First, a Christ follower is someone who abides. They stay with Jesus. They believe the truth that apart from him, they can do nothing. And with him, they can do all things for his glory. A relationship with Jesus is not a one-time thing, but an ongoing passionate pursuit of his presence in their lives. Simply put, it's impossible to follow Christ without abiding in him. Second, a Christ follower connects. By God's design, a true follower is never on a solo mission. Rather, they actively gather together with other followers of Jesus for community, friendship, and growth as a family of God. Like any family, they know that they need others around them and that their strengths and gifts are needed by others also. And finally, a Christ follower multiplies. They pursue the Great Commission in the spirit of the Great Commandment. They know that all they have heard and seen cannot be kept to themselves, and they obediently share this truth with others around them. As they follow Christ, they respond to the undeniable command to make disciples and to take, and to take care of those in need. Abide, connect, and multiply are three simple words to define what a Christ follower looks like and are expressed in three ways. God time, which is abide. Gather time is to connect and go time is to multiply and that is our vision at KVC. But how do you get there? How do you learn to live your life to what matters the most as a follower of Christ? Abiding in the Lord, connecting with fellow believers and sharing with the world are all built on relationships. Healthy relationships require time. So we encourage you to learn and begin the journey of the 3G life. We're excited about the 3G life. This whole month of February, we'll be signing up. This is for everyone at KVC, whether you've been here coming for a few weeks, months, or you've been here for years. These are our core values. This is what God is saying to us this year. Sharpen our focus. And the Bible also says iron sharpens iron. So we will sharpen one another as we go through this 3G life. We look forward to seeing you there. God bless.